Hey everybody, it is I, Super Paul Games. Welcome back to the Navy Football Saga. We're going to be playing Georgia. This is our oldest arch rival in the LP. I'm not saying in Navy's real history, but um, I think this might be the only team we've played every year outside of Air Force Hello, and I'm Army. Brad Nessler, and beside me in the booth is Kirk Herbstreit. Aaron Andrews is also with us. She'll be reporting from the sidelines. Football Thanks makes us what? Tonight's game brought to you by ESPN and EA Sports. We'll see the Navy Midshipmen and the Georgia Bulldogs. Rough, rough. <laughs> Hopefully we'll make it so they have a rough the time today. The hedges at Sanford Stadium are as old as the stadium itself, dating back to the first game played here in 1929. Kickoff from Athens, Georgia is next. It's one of those nights when you wish this game was being played indoors. What are you talking about, pussy? I love outdoor games and the elements. It's a good time, too, to rely on your running game. The sign says they're the best, but that's not true. I think they are ranked in the top 25. We're number three in the nation right now. And here come the Bulldogs. Behind, um... Who are we behind? Ohio State, and I forget who else. This appears to be a heck of a late season matchup. They're playing today in hopes of impressing the pollsters and the bowl reps. For Navy, the quarterback's got to be first on their list of defensive concerns. Brad, this is the prototypical quarterback. He's smart, strong, and he makes his teammates better. Now we had to mid I said about our quarterback, off. but Thomas, who's been very good at his rookie year, will be nervous. He's been nervous in like almost every road game we've had. Chocolate and peanut butter. We're gonna call heads. Give me heads, baby. Uh, we will kick off. Navy is lined up for the opening kickoff. So kick off, you go. freak! Boom. That was actually a really good kick. He'll return it from the one. He gets out to about the 18-yard line. So now the offense and defense. Oh, somebody looks like they're injured already on the ground. Great. They'll go to work at the 18. Remember when they used to kick it off from back farther in the pros? Not because they don't even want to get hurt. Oh man, they kick it from so much closer. So it usually goes in the end zone. You don't have many cool returns. Defense. Down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Did yeah, get him? Down the left sideline. Nice. Does not come down with it. Either way, it would have been out of bounds. Man, this reminds me of when I lived down south. Because you can see SEC on the field. Third down. You see all these SEC games down south. I'm like, I don't care. I'm from. The Midwest, show me Big Ten games. But the truth is I don't watch much college football. Give me the pros. Oh, you turd! Cobain, man, just he needed his head on a swivel right there. We had great pressure. Cobain's like, oh shit, what'd you do? That's number 24. Not woohoo at all. If we lose, we're not going to the national championship. We need to win this game. This is our last big game. We have one more game after this, which is against Army. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideouts. He tried to hit his receiver. Man, again! Taking on Cobain. Come in time, just repetition, throwing that same pass over and over, and he'll be fine. Get somebody the get him! Oh, the reason I grabbed the middle linebackers, I thought it was going to be a run. But somebody grabbed up on him. Somebody wanted to give the king a hug. We've got third and three here. Ball on the 49 yard line. There you go. Get that. Oh, yes! Woo. That's some good sentence structure. That's how you would diagram a sentence. He was in school. Get some. Mm, ah, yes. They're going for it. Cockknobbers. What the hell? 
in this it's field position? Is getting set to go for it. Does that mean the coach has no faith in their team, or does he have a lot of faith in their team? Somebody get him! There you go! I have no idea why this early in the game they went for it on fourth down. But that's got us some good field position. What does he mean, got to go for it to get something going? Easy Thomas is nervous as fuck. Three yard game. Good pressure from the defense. They brought the heat. Wasn't much room for the running back to work with. From their own 49 yard line. Second down. Oh man, yeah. Put everybody to the left. Yeah, oh shit. Oh yeah. Man, that was Wolfie. Wolfie over a thousand yards for the season. That should have been a busted play. We've got a first and ten. There you go, Club Panic coming through again. Last couple of games, he's really come through with some big catches. Well, Brad, that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving. Woo! Makes it easier when you have a short field. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 21 yard line. Ooh, nice run again by Wolfie. <coughs> Sorry about that. Six yard gain. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. They line up in the red zone for the first time today. I'm going to be like, sorry, Bulldogs, but we're going to put you down. Is that too dark? Enjoy the dancing pixelated crowd. The reason they're pixelated is they can't compare to the glory of acid goat dancing. I'm sure the developers are the thing that. We only have so many polygons. Put them all in the goat. Skinner, you suck. Skinner picks up a yard on the play. No, I don't want screw that. Nothing against Skinner. Skinner is an okay backup. I'm guessing that they're resting um Nico Wolfie. Let's give it to the fullback. Big man. There you go. Keep pushing, big man. That's four yards on the play. That makes it three. Do we have a I form play like that? We don't want any big sneak. We want something that's kind of quick to run. Yeah, fullback dive to the right. Third and goal from the two yard line. The crowd is really letting Come on, get that push. Oh, that makes me mad. <laughs> Fuck it, we're going for it. Everybody, we're just going to slam it right up the middle of the halfback. It's up to Indigo Wolfie. You can see Thomas is nervous. He doesn't know those receivers. It's not a passing play, though. There we go. Get that block. Woohoo. Where you at, Acid Go? we got to celebrate. You're not asked to go. You suck. <laughs> like, oh man, I suck. Sorry, we're just disappointed. By uh, no, lack of asked to go, not by that. Pays for it going for it on fourth down. It's like I say, if you can't get fourth in a yard, you don't deserve to win. And it's good. Hey, they got a bulldog statue there. Sinners. Worshipping your evil idols. New to be Georgia Sinners. <laughs> Boom! Man, Muhammad's taking some leg roids today. Or we got a little wind behind us. I'm okay with both. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on the 
this next drive. They'll start. It helps us a lot line. though that they First went for it on that fourth down, giving us really good field position. Yo! First down. I cannot believe he caught that and got yards off of it. We had such good pressure. Somebody was just watching that. The home players was like, that's a great catch. Go play it. You gotta tackle him. Did you see that catch, coach? I did. I'll tackle him before I punch you. Which isn't much of a threat since most of these guys are going to be several inches taller than me. Like 100 pounds heavier with muscle. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. Probably weakly bounce my hand off and get hurt, and then they shove me down. <laughs> Stop shoving me! Nice tackle. King's having a pretty good season. Look at that, man. 51 tackles, four sacks, no picks, but from their own. Our our defense isn't very big on getting down. picks this year. That is the one part of the defense that isn't our best. That we've ever had. The rest of them has been pretty good, though. Ah! Tackle him. Makes it out to about the 39. Good solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. Damn you, Turner and Hooch. Turner and Cooch. It's probably a porn Turner film from the 80s. I don't know what I'm talking about, but it probably is. Get, what are you doing, 53? That's King, the one they're talking about doing so good. He just watched the Sun tackle him. Way overran him. Needless to say, I'm not very happy with that. From the 41 yard line, it's first. We're gonna bring a blitz. Even with that pressure, still gets the pass off. Five-yard gain. You're making me mad, team. I'm a bear. Actually, this plane is unbearable. Give to the tailback. Makes it out to about the 23. Well, oh, you can see in the bottom. I said they're in the top 25. You can see Georgia's ranked number 21 in the nation right now. First and 10. Ball on the 23. And they're kind of having their way with our defense. Not such a fan of that. Get up, Brick! Yeah, Frazier! Go, Frazier, go! That's a pick six. Holy shit. We, I was talking earlier how we don't get a lot of picks. Frazier got a huge play. pick right there. Excellent interception and an even better return. Mine. <laughs> Not only does that make me happy because we scored, they kind of were having their way with our defense. And that's the way to turn momentum around in a hurry. You can hear how quiet the stadium is. Anchors away. Ready to kick. Do it again, Mohammed. Kick it in the end zone. Makes it out to maybe the 19 yard line. Oh, we injured him. See, that's why if someone kicks it in the end zone, don't run it out. Just take a knee. Especially in the NFL the way it is now. Somebody get there on our side. Oh, big dickus. I guess the defense took that as a challenge. I guess that was my pregame speech. Or they overheard me. Yeah, these guys can't intercept shit. All right, coach, we'll show you. Two big picks already for the team. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44. 
All right, we're gonna kick it out to the left. No! Wow, they broke right through the center right there. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. No, oh, ten little soul. The guy like slapped into his hands and couldn't come down with it. Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. Get your hands off my balls. Now they need to get it inside the 46. No, sheepies. Not enough. I didn't know he was kicking to the right. Was that an option route? <laughs> I thought he was supposed to do kind of a post route. Here at Sanford Stadium. The midshipmen, 14, the Bulldogs, nothing. We're going to punt it here. We're not going to make the mistake they made of giving the other team good field position. Fourth down, here comes the punter looking to boot this one away. Gray is back deep to return. He punts this one high in the air. Somebody get there. Ah, could have been a better punt. The quarterback threw an interception on their last drive. Yeah, throw another pick, dude. Here. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. I pick you, you interception, too. After one play. Takes a handoff inside and stopped immediately. It's always a good feeling when we got a kind of light three-man front like that. We're able to hold them to a three-yard run. <laughs> well, they took advantage of it. That's what I said, announcer. Is he actually going to catch that? Oh. <laughs> well, I can't believe he got that. From their own 38 yard line. Second down. Come on, defense. There we go. Right up in the morning. Morning's willing to give you a hug. Don't you shove my guy. Rude. From their own 40 yard line. It's third down. Come on, defense. Give us that ball back. <laughs> I'm frustrated like number 60 there. Morton just like, Arr! First and ten. Yeah, ancient stranger up there on the line, all tight. Everybody up to stop the run. Somebody get through? Here comes a pressure. He had all day. Incomplete. Luckily, we had guys playing good coverage downfield. to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Second and ten. Oh no. <laughs> Jordan on the give. It out to about the uh, I, I guess I need to go to a four-man front. I'm mean, using a lot of that three-man front because we got two picks off of plays in that formation. At least I think they were both out of that formation. Oh, that is disappointing. Oh, and one of our guys is injured. That guy just kind of shake and baked right through the heart of our line. It's second and four. This is the ninth play of this drive. Come on, defense. Get us that ball back. I can't say it enough. Again with the run. And they make the stop at the 25. I hope that's not a face mask on us. Oh. Somebody grab the tackle bar. Damn it, Moz. They're giving away three yards and only making life easier for the guys on the other side of the ball. First down on the 12, and they can smell the goal. Uh-oh, Marshall's rib, uh, ribs are bruised. We don't ever go into this. We're going to go to the depth chart a second. 
Uh, where's the depth chart? Strategy! Shows how seldom we actually go into it during a game. Well, let's go to safety. Why is... Oh, click taser is injured! That's why Moz is playing. Yeah, because click taser was a game or two ago. Had a major injury where he's out for, I think, the rest of the season. Because every time I'd see Moz's name, I'm like, who the hell is that? Five-yard gain. We might have broken him. Uh, Marshall, you can rest. We need you back. Here's the 11th play of the drive. It's second down. Come on, defense. There you go. Get some pressure. Oh. Fuck. That is frustrating. We had great pressure right up in his face. Tell me we injured their quarterback at least. You see the Navy fans are like, what the hell is that? I don't know. You know, sometimes people score. Is that their quarterback that we just injured for four weeks? Because it said somebody's out for four weeks. You've been working on your railroad lies. I don't think any of you work on the railroad. This ain't no railroad college. Oh no, I meant to fair catch it! They'll bring him down at the 19 yard line. Not Poor club panic. The last time this offense had the ball. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 19 yard line. Oh shit! Oh man, a lot of pressure right there, right in his face. We even have too much time. We had no time. Navy up seven points. Uh, can we hike the ball? Get set, everybody. There we go, Butler. The Butler did it. Big old game. You mean that throw was perfect. Considering there was a very small area right there where he was open. That was a great throw. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 50. Navy is up by a touchdown. Now Sheepies adjust the play at the, on the streak. Streaky freak! Quick roll out left. He wants to throw. He lets it go. Oh, nobody could get there. I don't know why that was such a bad throw. He had time to set his feet. There we go, Butler again. Man, they didn't want to cover the guy. That's a Christmas present. Come early. Thanks, Coach Santa. First and ten. Ball on the twenty-five. They totally blew it there with that coverage. Just leaving one of our guys. Oh, uncovered. Nice run by Wolfie. Four yards on that play. We really need to get another score here. We want to have a two-score lead if at all possible going into the half. From the 21-yard line, second down. Georgia, more like... Oh, I don't want to say... I was going to say Georgia, but I, I've been to Georgia before. I liked it. Nice run there. They gained five yards there. All right, offensive line. Get us that one. Push their big dudes around. In the red zone again. Let's see if it'll be another touchdown. Hog mollies is the weird term it is. Not defense, offense. See the little um, cheering section? Oh, did I audible? I hope I didn't. Oh, yeah! Wolfie had the shake and bake. That guy thought he was coming on the inside on a blitz. And Wolfie's just like running around you. I was going to say on the right, you can see our cheering section. Because they're wearing navy colors. That or it's just the t-shirt and jeans dude showed up. <laughs> that would be like me. 
You see that all on the right. White t-shirt and jeans group. Here's the eighth play of the series. First down. Comfortable, what can I say? No! That makes me mad. Well, if you're going to do anything, you're not going to do anything if the moment you're handed the ball, there's um, a defender on you. Somebody did not block well in the middle. All right, Mr. Rogers, it's time to get some yards. Oh, that didn't work. We didn't even get an inch on there. Wait, uh, let's go shotgun. We're gonna empty it out. Everybody, get out there. Here's third and eleven. Ball on the eleven-yard line. Yeah, no, Thomas. Oh, trying to get it to Tenlo Soul. He was open for a second because the throw wasn't good under pressure. Oh, that sucks. Tenlo did a good job of getting open, but just that throw was a little not what we wanted. We've got a first and ten. How dare you taunt us, Georgia Bulldog? I'm kind of surprised they're running it. They got all their timeouts. If they wanted to, they could really go for it. From their own 16-yard line, it's second down. Maybe they're just satisfied going to the half, only down by one score with the way the game's gone. Yeah! Go defense! Go King! Man, our defense has been huge today. But you can be sure they'll go to him again. Death Haven's like, give me that ball. Alright, we're not running the same play that I threw the pick on last time. Don't you review that? No! At the possible fumble. The booth agrees looks with like the call it's... on the field. It was indeed a fumble. Yeah, as I say, it looked like it was out. It's first down on the 10-yard line. We have all of our timeouts. Not much time left, though. Oh! Kind of threw a jump ball, but nobody got up for it. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 11-yard line. Oh, you gotta watch out there on the right. Oh, damn it! Overthrew it! He had sheepies wide open. He just gave it too much. Settle down, kid. Takes a snap and he's in trouble. And he shoved out of bounds. Yeah, we lost some yards, but had to get out of the bounds right away. Make sure the clock stopped. At that point, if we threw it, we might not have a chance at the field goal. Uh, oh, it hits the upright. No. The ghost of bad kicking gets us again. Shit. I should have just kicked right away. Our score here at Sanford Stadium. Navy, that is disappointing. Georgia, seven, Defense got be getting a little frustrated because they've been doing really good, and our offense has been um, not consistent. Not horrible, but not consistent. Oh my God, that's like the best blocking we've had for a return on a kickoff. Thomas doesn't like what he sees. Rolls right. There we go, Butler. Haha, <laughs> you like that spin? I do. I was asking the defender. If you liked it too, that's awesome. 
this secondary did a lot of talking about how they were going to dominate these receivers. I think this is well, they talked they shit about our team. On the field. Forget about you hear that, receivers? Track. They told shit they about how they're all going to dominate you. Fires deep down the right side. Ha <laughs> Woods coming through. Dominate this. So first down, they go to the air and pick up huge yardage. Well, that was just a well-executed play. They picked the perfect time to stretch the defense with a passing play, and it worked. All right, running game. It's very important here that we keep this going. Navy, get in that end zone. Looking at first and goal. Thomas still very nervous on the road. Hopefully next season he won't be. Give to the tailback and he's met in the back for you. He was never able to get ahead of steam on that carry. From the nine yard line, it's second down. Navy is up a score. Thomas, adjust the play at the line. No, Club Gang's like, what am I doing? You're running a fly route. Keepies with the touchdown. And that one worked just like they draw it up, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, you're exactly right. Does that have to go around here somewhere we can celebrate with him? Good route by the receivers. Results, touchdown. No. Has to go. I know you're at the game. It's probably hiding behind the hedge high as shit. High as fuck. I see leprechauns everywhere, man. It's not Notre Dame. Nice catch by Sheepies. Great throw by Thomas. Georgia fans are like, not again. We've done pretty good against them historically. Woo! He splits the uprights with the extra point. So we take a moment here. Let's check out the drive summary. Navy, kick this one off. Nice two-score lead. Hopefully our defense can get the ball back and we can keep building on that. You know what would be funny, but I hope it doesn't happen, is if we won this game, became number two in the nation, and then if we lost against um, Army. <laughs> They'll take over at the 20. First down, 10 yards to go. Best thing that could happen would be for us to win this week and for Ohio State to lose. Then we'd almost be guaranteed, as long as we could beat Army, a playoff, our, playoff spot. Sorry, uh, spot in the national championship. Second and eight coming up here. Thinking too much about real football, man. I love this football season. Best time of the year. Get him! Don't let him go. Nice tackle. Job by the defense to overpower the offensive line. Yeah, King's had a lot of good tackles this year. That was King coming down with him. From their own 20 yard line. Third down. Looks to pass. Oh, somebody don't let him escape. Oh my. Tackle made the 36 yard line. If you're the defense, oh. I didn't just poop myself. Well, maybe a little bit. In rage. Great job by the wide receiver to come back for. Generally aren't very good in one-on-one -on -one coverage. I thought we had him here, though. First and ten. Ball on the 36. Yeah, their running game is pretty damn solid. Four yard gain for uh, Weebly McGee. Heard somebody barking. Maybe it's the Georgia Bulldog. Where's the doggy? I want to pet him. No more. Get back in your spot. I like doggies. Oh, thank God that guy bumped over to Moran. If he'd gone just a little bit more to the right, that would have been a first. The offensive line has got to do a better job of making space because that was just a punishing hit. Oh, get there, get there. Nice. 
touchdown. Greg wasn't going to let him go by. I was more worried about, like, the safety coming up. But that worked out. Good job, defense, getting us that ball back. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Big question now is do we run or just open the offense up again? Thomas looked great in the last drive. He's taken down at the 15-yard line. Well, they got the result you always want on the last drive. Let's see if it happens again. As long as this quarterback has time to throw, then you can guarantee that he'll find the open man. Woohoo, yeah! He did right there. Oh, Club Panic with such a juke move. Man, he is coming to his own the last few games. Woo! Holy shit. If you can get open and hold on to the passes, chances are you're gonna have a good game. And that's exactly what this That run after the catch. That's Thomas. I don't know why his eyes are closed. Great run after the catch. That spin move was huge. He just spun through a group of them. Like a tornado. Oh, the Bulldog said, suck it. It's like, I bet all my money on this. Don't feel bad. I made bad choices in life. About money too, Bulldog. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> has to go take a poop on their lawn. 85-yard reception. Boom. And he adds the extra point. Set to kick this one away. Unfortunately, a couple of our receivers, I think, are seniors. I think Tenlo Soul might be a senior this year. I don't know if Club Panic is. Tackle with the 21 yard line. They were forced to punt the ball away the last time they had it. They'll be looking for a little more out of their offense on this possession. Nah, they, they can punt again. It's all right. It's first and Man, I love that quick strike. Oh, a screen. Pretty good screen, too. Down at the 32. Well played by the offensive line to sell the defense on the pass rush. And then get out they got me on it. For a moment there, I was just like, we're getting good pressure. Oh, shit, Bucks. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 32. No, 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 no. Jordan Somebody please tackle him. Thank you. He makes it to the 35-yard line. Jordan gets three yards on the play. That'll make it second to seven. From their own 35-yard line. Second down. Man, there are not a lot of Navy fans here. It's that one little section in the... Oh, right side. Somebody. And down he goes at the 47. And he busts a huge gainer there. Familiar. It looks like the exact same play they ran previously. Trying to embarrass me. Nah. Alright, we'll blitz. First and ten. Ball on the four. Little three man front. There's no way he can possibly run through the giant gaps there. Foolproof plan. Oh no, it wasn't foolproof at all. <laughs> I guess if they want to keep running it, it's okay. It's a little early to Assume we've won, because we definitely haven't yet. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the but the more seven. time they want to waste, not pick up the pace, better for us. There you go. Nice job, Rick. You ran into a brick wall. They're about four yards away here on third down. What are you doing, Morton? I will hypnotize them. With my hypnotistic song. Well, maybe it works. They gotta go for it here, right? Fourth and three? No, they're gonna punt? I don't trust them. It's fourth down, and they're ready to punt this one away. No, the studio! Sure, let it go! That's my fault. Normally you should not go, uh, and catch that. It might be good, like it could have took a funky bounce in the rain. That would have helped them. That corner there by Butler, a little dance he did, it makes me wonder if he's blitzing. Shit. 
We got one negative yard. So we'll start this down with similar field position. Second down and 11. Ball on their own 14. Ooh, Butler. No, 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 no. Where are you throwing it to? Damn it, Thomas. He overthrew it. If he would have thrown it on a line like I wanted him to, he would have had Butler. Oh, that was a bad throw. What are you thinking, kid? Is that Preston Garvey over there on the right side? No, I'm not going to help out another settlement. Back to pass. And they make the stop at the 22-yard line. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. This was the ref. The guy got a little bit of a pick from the ref. He bumped, uh, our defender bumped the ref and slowed down a little bit. Stupid ref working for the Bulldogs. Two yard line. First down. Latimer rocks back on first down. Yeah, you punch him in the butt. Good, you broke him. <laughs> that brings an end to the third quarter. Our score here in Athens, Navy 28, Georgia 7. Well, as long as we don't do any more stupid turnovers. What? There's no power in the stadium. A hurricane. Was the game the designed by people who went to Georgia? Who refused to ever show Georgia losing? You know what SC stands? SEC stands for there? Suck Eli's cock. Oh. Don't make no sense. Hit him! Uh, come on, defense. Keep him out of there. From the seven yard line. First down. So their last red zone visit resulted Ooh. in a touchdown. Let's see if the defense can hold them this time. <laughs> Thank God. I got worried there for a moment. Number 51, Frazier, when he pulled back. It's like, you better not let him just run by you. But he did a good solo tackle right there. Second down. Ten yards away from a score. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Give me the ball. Hey, that's a heads up play there by the defender. Get those hands up and something good may just happen. Sounds creepy when it says it that way. It's third and goal from the 10. They'll probably look to the air here. Get back there, linebacker. You're supposed to cover the zone in the middle. There you go. Yeah. Good coverage sack. scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. Flab in your face. They'll call on the field goal unit here. That's uh, all right. Good job by the defense holding them to a field goal attempt. Oh, and they missed. That makes me feel better about our missed field goal. And this defense comes away with a small victory. Still, our score, Navy more than a small victory, that's a huge victory because they didn't get on the board there with more points. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. Thomas doesn't like what he sees. Keep his block. Butler going a streak. There you go, Butler! <laughs> Wow, I love it when they're wide open like that. And for Butler, that's another catch, and that puts him at 100 yards for the game. If you can get open and hold on to the passes, chances are you're going to have a good We might have two receivers with over 100 yards between him and Club Panic with that huge gain. That creaky noise was my chair. It wasn't a victory fart. Or was it? It was my chair. <laughs> Drop 
Drops back to pass. There you go, Butler. Nice. Look at that. Almost 300 yards passing for Thomas. Probably ought to get the running game back involved. It's a weird season. Most years, the running game carried us. From the and we have a good halfback. Wolfie's awesome. Down. And Wolfie's just a freshman, too. Fresh man. Ha-ha! Ah, oh, shit. Couldn't break that last one. Still a really good game. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. Woohoo indeed. Four yard line. First down. Just hope we get the um, credit and respect we deserve in the polls. That's another first. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. It makes an offense so much more versatile. Honestly, if we can score a touchdown here, we probably are gonna win the game. First down. Their last red zone trip resulted in a touchdown. I don't expect this one to be any different. He may have changed things up here. Come on, Tenlo Soul. Touchdown! For the touchdown. That gives him the team's all-time mark for receiving yards. Good for him. He's always been a fierce. That must be his first catch today. Because we hear that every game this season, because he's constantly breaking the career record at Navy. Well, if you're only going to have one catch, that's the huge pivotal one to have. That might have broken the record. I thought he had the career record, too, for receiving touchdowns. That might have broke two records of his. And he hits the PAT. And now we're going to take a look at the drive summary. Nice shot of the uh, goalpost right there. <laughs> Yeah, that's some real nice goalposts they got there in Georgia. Mohammed, ready to kick. Hard to believe the season is almost done already. Only one more game after this in the regular season. And then a bowl game. He'll return it from the one. That is one thing. Even if we lose the next game. I mean, technically we're not done here. <laughs> I guess we could give up something horrible. Ooh, are the Georgia fans going to leave? They've given up on their time. team. Ha ha. This guy won't hang his head. If he has another opportunity to kick one, he'll be ready to go. Uh, I was going to say, no matter what, we should get a bowl game. I guess that's Schadenfreude enjoying their own fans giving up on him. Oh, almost another pick. Maybe it's because it was cold, cold and wet. That's why we've had guys who caught well. Usually when it's nice out, our guys are like, oh, I can't catch. Yeah, you ain't going nowhere. You should try to run around the brick house, not through it. play was supposed to go. He's looking to pass. He's looking deep down the No! Oh, oh man, that sucks. That was actually a really good throw by their quarterback. Yeah! Doug Johnson! Go, go, go! Oh, the quarterback's trying to get him! <laughs> That's hilarious. Their quarterback has thrown more pick sixes. He's thrown more touchdowns to our guys than he has to his own guys. This has got to convince the coach committee, right? The media's polls that we deserve to be in the big game? Very quiet here in Georgia now. Boom! And he converts the extra point. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Navy 42, Georgia 7. So I were the number three uh, team in the nation. Country in the nation. <laughs> Coach, are you drunk again? I wish. 
takes it to the 22-yard line. Offense comes back out looking to improve from their last effort. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I would be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. It says pressure, but we haven't brought many blitzes. And we haven't gotten a lot of pressure, honestly. Oh, we almost had some right there. And he's finally shut down at the 43. Good pass, unfortunate for us. Bring that blitz. Get him. Oh, that blitz is doing nothing. Everybody got picked up on that blitz. Damn it. Right around the 10 yard line. Guys, when we were in practice this week, you kind of got the feeling that they might run a little no huddle. In fact, here it comes. Drops back on first down. Oh, he's got all day. That's not good. Oh, that was almost picked. The defense always likes to see a pass broken up, but getting the turnover would have been really big. Yeah, I wish we would have got the turnover right there. From the 10 yard line. It's second down. Overload the left side. Oh, it didn't work at all. Don't you let him in there. Oh, they're friends. Third down and three coming up. Ball on the three-yard line. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Well, they're not going to win it, but they're still playing hard out there. Yeah, I will give it to Georgia. They didn't give up. That's got to be so hard to do in an outfit like that. When your head's massive. And he converts the extra point. They, they got an onside kick it, yeah. Rodgers is on our hands team? Tenlo Soul! Nice catch. Well, any dreams they had of a comeback just ended right there. Yeah, Brad, even if they were able to recover that onside kick, they still probably would not have had enough time. Navy is winning big. Just under three to go in regulation. He looks to throw on first down. Decides to tuck it in and he's got space. He gets hit Don't you touch the quarterback. I shouldn't have gone for it like that. I was kind of pissed that they tried to unside it on us. Except that we were a better team than not you. Navy with a commanding lead. Thomas doesn't like what he sees. No! Oh, he got popped. He drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. That makes it second and ten. Second and ten. Navy up by a bunch. Just over two minutes in the game. They give to the tailback. And he's tackled at the 22. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. All right, we're going to do something we don't do most of the time. We're going to go to the depth chart. I know it's a little anticlimactic. Um... We're going to put in some backups. We're going to put Skinner in for Wolfie, and we're going to put Mr. America in for Thomas because there's no reason to get them injured at this point of the game. Not one. Oops, I don't want to hail Mary of all things. It's third and eight. Just let that clock keep running. Big margin. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. Fans are hopeful or deluded. Well, that was not so graceful. Poor Mr. America. If you can't find a receiver, uh -oh. get out of the pocket and throw 71 just watched it happen. Good blocking, dude. Fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. 
Oh, I don't want to punt from the here. Now to call the signals. Thomas doesn't like what he sees. Wait, why is Thomas in? Did Mr. America just get injured on that play? I don't know why he didn't try and catch the that. Maybe he didn't want to get popped. It's all right. Anytime you're in a situation like this, take the points and build up the lead. Don't risk coming away with nothing. Should be interesting to see how this affects the rest of the game. Yeah, we won. I mean, even if they score here, we've got such a lead. They're not going to mount it. I mean, sir, mount it. That's the sexy British Lord. God dang it. Uh, Mr. America, you can rest. The poor guy came in for one play and he got injured. Maybe it's a good thing I did put him in, though, and it wasn't Thomas that got injured there. Back to pass. Tackle him in bounds. He's tackled at the 43 yard line. The offense calls a timeout. They only have one timeout left. I don't know why they're running, but that's okay. He meets the defense. Jordan gets around three. I guess they're going to accept that they have lost the superior team. It was fun playing Georgia again. Second down. I try and get them on the schedule every year. Because the first year we played, they were on the schedule. So it's fun playing them. No, oh, he's like, bitch, get out of here. That's like playing basketball. Would you try and go up and someone just slaps it out of your way? Third and seven. Somebody, there you go. When you get in these third down situations, a confident offense expects to get the yardage they need on the ground. It's a good job. Kind of surprised they don't let the clock down. run out here. Doesn't really matter though, as long as nobody gets hurt. set to go to the air, sacked, and they'll turn it over. But you have to admire the defense for showing some pride here. The game's obviously out of hand. Mr. America, are you in? We're gonna give you a shot. Just to take a shot. Navy in control. We're going to have it too. Ten low sower club panic. We're just going to throw a bomb. Sheepies out. The Guard that. Rolling out to the left side. Come on, don't let the defender in your way. Oh, club panic almost had it. Either way, that was outstanding. This is our last major game of the year, like I said. Don't get me wrong. The next game is very important. It's a tradition. And if we lose that game, we're not going to get a good bowl game. But that should be an easier game. We dominated Georgia. We are undefeated. We're like 11-0. and 0. Yeah, Frazier's like, you know I'm going to go score a touchdown now. Of chocolate and Our defense butter. scored as many touchdowns as their Coming entire game, team. I thought that these two teams were pretty evenly matched. So the fact that they won by such a comfortable margin really says a lot about what a great game they played. Navy was so impressive in this win. I thought this was going to be nip and tuck, but they just ran these guys out of the stadium. Good game, Georgia. Good game indeed. It was pretty tight early on. They, they, they played well in the first quarter. And for winning today's player of the game, EA Sports will make a $10,000 donation. Over 300 yards to passing for Thomas. Scholarship fund. For Navy, they keep their unbeaten record intact. And for Georgia, a loss today drops them to 7-4 and four, heading into their final game of the regular season. That'll do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 11. For Kirk Herbstreet and Aaron Andrews, I'm Brad Nessler. Yeah, our defense so huge today. All those interceptions, the most we've had, I think, all year in a game. Here's the quarterback mad. Oh, I threw it to the wrong guy. Or was it actually the right guy? Tumlo, so once again, breaking Navy records. It's going to be a shame when he moves on. This is the rain track part. <laughs> Superman. Oh, that's Club Panic with one of his great catches. I wonder if he had 100 yards. Good camera work. It's a shrubbery. 
So let's go look at game stats before I head off. Thanks for watching, everybody. Poor Mr. America was in there for one thing where he got popped. Thomas had a pretty good game. Did have a couple picks, but look at that. 300 yards passing, three touchdowns. Wolfie had a good game rushing. Only 14 attempts, though. Poor Mr. America, negative 11 yards. He's actually a good quarterback, though. Look at that. We did. We had two quarterbacks. I'm sorry. Two wide receivers with over 100 yards receiving. Butler and Club Panic. Man, that was a good game. Well, everybody, I'll see you all next time. Our defense. Can I get over here to picks? Yep, three picks. And uh, I think they forced a fumble, too. I'll see you all next time when we play the last game of the regular season. Go Navy!